Hi, this is Ceramic85 and today I will show you how to refill your Bosch Aero Twin windshield wipers. Therefore we take them off the vehicle. In this case it is a hook that you open the cap and then you slide it off towards the vehicle and then you can take it out of the hole. And there you have the wiper and you see it's already torn apart a little bit so it definitely makes sense to replace them at this point. Now we're here on the workbench of my garage and I ordered these Hybrox refills for almost every type of flat windshield wiper and they come in a box of six for about 10 bucks which is a pretty good price if you compare them. Sometimes you get two for eight bucks or something so if you get six you can switch your vehicle um, up to like three times or you have uh, multiple vehicles where you want to switch these then you have six and you can refill all your vehicles so check the link in the video description for this product and it's very good quality it's a name brand um, refill manufacturer and they also make windshield wipers and they make these for a very good price a good quality I've used them before and I was very pleased and happy with this product so make sure you check out the link in the video description okay back to our Aero Twin here and if you want to open these go for the for the cap where it says Bosch on it in this case and uh, we want to slide this cap off so this this cap doesn't come off that easy so I'm pushing it up here with my finger and at the same time I'm using a small screwdriver to get underneath this hook while I push it upwards. So I push it upwards at the same time. And once these little hooks behind here snap out, you can slide the cap off. Put the cap here for now, and then we can start sliding off the old rubber. Um, you could start sliding on the in the in the back that's e and then it easily slides off here you can see how it comes out and you don't want to you want to keep these two metal places apart from each other to be able to slide the new one in so we take one of the new rubbers here and we just start sliding it back in the same way the old one came out oh, i hope you can see this in the video Try to make it as visual as possible for you here. So we'll slide this carefully in. Slide it all the way to the end. Like that. And uh, now we can cut it. I'm using this carpet knife here. Um, or you can use scissors, no problem, and cut it right where the where the metal where these two metal sticks end. So I'm going to cut it like right there. And if you cut it at the right spot, then you can put the cap back on. A little tricky because it has these, these two notches in there. You see that? And that is sometimes a little tough to get over the actual top of the rubber. So once you have the notches over the rubber, and it clicks back in place. There you go. Make sure it's not too long so that it fits nicely in between the caps. So for a very good price, you are able to switch these rubbers. It's less than two bucks per rubber here, per windshield wiper, and we're ready to put it back on. Okay, we're back here on the hood of the car. You slide the, the uh, windshield hook through this hole here from the cap and then hook it there just like that 
close the cap and you're ready to go. Thank you very much for joining me today. I hope this video helped you out by refilling your Bosch Aero Twins yourself and saving a lot of money. Thank you very much for watching and I see you next time. This is Jeremy 85 signing out.